Hallelujah to the Lamb of the Living God. Praise be to Jesus. We are looking into a subject of uh, getting established in the truth. One thing we share the bagge now then one Martha Deve. Satya Dali Stapi Salpadu Vantad. Part 4 today. The Lord wants His church, that is His bride, to be anchored by truth. The Lord desires truth in our inward part. Psalm 51, verse number 6, we have started our devotion. Kartunu Tanna Sabe. You know, Sabe Atana Madumagalu. Amen. Sabe you Satya the Mula Kawagi Stirapadi Salpadabek. Satya wu Langurakabek Sabegi. Anta Heri Atanu by Stane. Amen. Kirtane. I was a woman at the Arnea, Waka the Mele, Namadana Wana, Nau, Praram Bisi Devi Namawala Gay, Devu Satevan Nabestan. And we already seen what is truth. Truth is the Lord. Truth is Jesus, the nature of Jesus, the nature of Father. Hallelujah. That has to be there inside of us. If the Lord is not there, if we, the church, is not anchored by the truth, what will happen? Sabe, walage, satya terbeku. Namo walage, satya terbeku. Hallelujah. A satya te illa didre, enak tade, embudagi, devara vakya namake her tade. Truth is anchor and if the truth is not there, in Ephesians chapter 4, from verse number 14, if you start to read, you know, it describes, you know, uh, how our life will be if we are not anchored by the truth. We will be just like a sheep, you know, that is tossed through the wind. We will be just like babies. Hallelujah. Wherever the wind will blow, you know, we will make, uh, uh, you know, our move towards that uh, direction. If a senakne adhyaya dali, satyavu nammali illa didre, nao hege irtheve, embudagi devara vakya namagi herthade. Gali badadu kondu hogu avara hage irtheve. Hadugu yava kadege, gali badithade akadege nao hoktheve. Durbodhane kalu embudagi ili efese sabe ili nao northeve. I don't want to go to read those scriptures, you know, read it for yourself. Ephesians chapter 4, verse number 14 and 15 and 16. Amen. Huh? Apostle Ephesians, Epustaka, Nakane, Adhyay, Adrali, Adna, Khadne, Adnarne, Vakke. Now, Makkalanthi Allah, Gali Badadu Kondu Hogu Over Hage Kuda, now Allah. Paul was concerned about the church. Hallelujah. Different doctrines. You know, man-made ideas, teachings. That is not truth. Manushanu madidanta bodhane. Manushanu vicharagalu, tatvagnyanagalu. Avu devara vakya Allah, devara satyate Allah. Avu devara swabhava varna tori sudilla. Paul was very much concerned for the church at Ephesus. And Jesus is also concerned, he was concerned about that church. In Revelation chapter 2, when Jesus is speaking to the churches, different churches, he's speaking up that church, church at Ephesus, and he's speaking to that church, you have left your first love. I have this one thing against you. Paulani ge Ephesus abe mele, bhaala ondu kaalajit. Yesu ge kuda sabe mele, bhaala kaalajit. Akadre, Ephesia, Sabea, Bagge, Apostle Prakatane, Apostle Alexemsi, Eredane, Adedel, now Norte, in the Modula Preti and Abiti. We have to love the truth. Hallelujah. Not loving, you know, different doctrines, 
that are coming into our ears through media, Facebook, YouTube. People are preaching so many different doctrines. That is not truth. If it is not based upon the truth of God's word, they were working the Satyate Mele, Bere Bere Bodhanekulu, Maddemagala Mulakana Veni, Norteve, Nirmita, Adarita, Allah Didradu, Satyate Allah, be anchored by the truth. The truth is the Lord and His word. God bless this word. They were Vakyavana Ashur, New Stiragoli, they were Vakya the Satyate Mele, they were in the. Yesu bin Indah, Dewi Wakti Wanash Ustri, Amen.